So yes, of course Superman has to pull his punches and not give his full strength against criminals. Just like Spider-Man, of course. And this applies to lots of stuff in life for Superman. Opening doors, hugging people, high five on the playground. But the biggest difference between Superman and Spider-Man is that Spider-Man's brand new to all this. From day one as an infant, Superman's parents were helping him balance his strength, figure out how to hide it. Spider-Man's a high school kid who immediately got into crime fighting, had to figure all this out on his own for the most part. This is one of my favorite scenes from Man of Steel where Clark Kent's getting bullied back when he was a kid. Even Clark's dad looking on in the background because he's not worried. But the bullies knock Clark down and he just takes it even as a little kid. And one of the coolest details is that he was holding on to this pipe and he crushed it. He channeled his anger into that. And he has the chat with his dad. I wanted to hit that kid. And his dad's like, of course you did. But you can't. You're different. And it's a great scene because Clark's dad says, are you okay? And Clark says, you know I'm not hurt. And his dad says, no, I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about inside. How are you? How's your mental state? Because Clark grew up with this amazing training from his dad, how to control his power, how to limit it, how to balance it. Much shorter learning curve for Spider-Man. 